So AMD just had their big announcement over at Computex 2018, and it turns out something that we reported on back in September because they could potentially have plans to produce a 32 core desktop processor, which was the possibility of a 32 core Threadripper chip. Well, looks to be legit. So AMD did announce a 32 core 64 thread Threadripper 2000 series chip. So we thought we were getting some big core counts when Intel announced their 28 core monster on their new platform on Cascade Lake X featuring six channel memory, which is well, really cool in itself, but AMD one upped them sort of with a 32 core CPU. Now, not only is it a 32 core CPU with 64 threads, it actually works on existing X399 platforms. So you don't even have to go out and get a whole new platform. I mean, if somehow 16 threads wasn't quite enough, you now can go all the way up to 32 on the existing platform. So if you bought in with even like a 1900X and you really wanted to upgrade to something big later on, you're well, you can definitely go to something big now. Now it is important to note that there are new motherboards coming out for X399, and we saw that MSI and their uh, their creator motherboards are have much beefier power delivery, and one can only assume that it is to handle the two extra dies on the Threadripper chip that are going to be activated. Now I would imagine that the current X399 boards, while they could handle the chip fine. I don't know how much overclocking potential you're gonna get on those. However, with the newer, refreshed, beefed up power delivery motherboards, you're probably gonna be able to get even better numbers or better overclocking with that. So I would imagine you're gonna get even better memory performance, just like what you got with Ryzen 2000 series. And that's, that's really, that's all good stuff. And something just as interesting is AMD did work along with Cooler Master to develop an RGB air cooler for this chip. They're gonna, uh, so far, what the naming I've seen is Wraith, the uh, Wraith Ripper, which is kind of cool. But what's interesting is while one company showed off their high core count chip using, well, some type of liquid cooling um, that was chilled to some, some type, and yeah, they overclocked it to five gigahertz. But have you seen the motherboards these things are running on? They're, they're wild, but it's still cool to see it. And, you know, the fact that they're anticipating being able to run a 32 core 16 or sorry 32 64 thread chip on air is just nothing short of impressive so rather than asking you guys some wild question what i'd like to hear is what would you do with 32 threads and or 32 cores and 64 threads there's so many it's hard to keep them straight but um love to hear from you guys down there in the comment section this has been Keith with WCCF Tech TV. If you'd like to see more about this particular topic, feel free to hit the link in the description below, and we'll catch you in the next video.